Why would they do that? Probably like 100 degrees outside. So, I'm hoping that's the case. Don't know how we did it, but we did it. Sir, I'm gonna give you guys a good one. We're all gonna play catch up, alright? I'm excited. you're watching this um i don't know what time it is wherever you are hi hello um my name is lauren if you're new welcome back to my channel if you're not new i kind of just cut my hair this week gave it like a little little trim i hate cutting my hair i hate getting my hair cut i hate chopping off any sort of length that i've gotten because i don't know I've, it took me so long to get my hair this long that cutting any little bit off just freaks me out and it always really has because I've always had short hair growing up and I could never get my hair this long ever and now that I finally have it this long just going to get a trim makes me want to cry so I just gave it like a little trim because when I did get my hair done I didn't get it cut but yeah what time is it? I'm patiently waiting for the skims drop um they just she just released this mesh collection and i wasn't too into it to be honest i mean some people are but it's just not i'm just not into stuff like that so they're restocking the cotton collection which i love i have i just recently bought this i don't know why i have it on a hanger but I do. It's this here. Let me let me show you. It's this ribbed bra, and I wanted to buy it in a couple other colors. And I also wanted to buy like the shorts that go with it, um, just for like lounging or sleeping. This is the most comfortable thing I have ever purchased. If you saw my try on haul, you know that I got these from skims and i love them but this is just so comfortable like i would sleep in this too i'm gonna go make a second coffee while i wait an hour because it's only 11 or it's 10 56 so i'm gonna make another coffee i'm gonna make an iced coffee i think and use my coffee cube so let's go do that i'm also well i'm wearing socks too but i'm also wearing the aloe yoga Biker shorts for the first time. Look how weird some of them, some of my little ice cubes come out because of the foam in from like the Nespresso. It gets like weird looking. Like that one looks so weird. So I've been trying out this Oatly oat milk. And one thing that I don't like about it is that there's sugar in it. Like the other one, I, I didn't see one that had no sugar. This one's just a low fat one. I honestly can't taste a difference in any single oat milk. I don't know if I'm just weird, but people say that some of them are watery. I don't know. I don't taste any difference in any of them, to be honest, but I don't know. I usually get just like unsweetened or like no sugar oat milk. It's just what I prefer because I don't like to have something added and extra in my coffee or anything like that, so. Yeah, but so far it's really good. It tastes yummy, but I did like that my other one as well that was like green. I forget the the name of it, but people don't like that one and I actually like it, but I don't know if I'm just don't care what oat milk is in my coffee, but this one's good. Nothing to complain about except for the sugar. Oh, it's Memorial Day weekend, so I think Christian and I are going to bite the bullet and buy a mattress. Because one of the mattresses that we found, I don't think anyone honestly cares, but if you are in the market, well, no, this video will be posted after Memorial Day. Anyways, I'll just give a quick rundown that the mattress that we were looking at is basically like $600 cheaper than what we were, than what it was listed as a few weeks ago when we went to go look at it. And if you know how much a king size mattress is, 
then you know that's like a huge discount. So I think we're just, and since we're splitting the mattress, we're really not spending that much money on this mattress. So I think we're just gonna go ahead and bite the bullet and buy the mattress this weekend because I heard that Memorial Day weekend mattress sales are the best sales of the year. Like they are the lowest, so. Okay, if you were paying attention to what I was using when I lit that candle earlier in the beginning of this vlog, but I was influenced by, I wish it would focus. I feel like I need a background. I was influenced by like a blogger that I follow and this is a USB charging lighter, but it's kind of scary. So you like turn it on and then you go like this. That's freaking me out. I feel like I'm gonna burn the house down with that but it's cool because it, you just charge it by usb and you don't need to basically buy a lighter ever again it will be linked on my amazon shop if you want to buy it for yourself i have you on my tripod like my little tripod last time i ordered the skim stuff they did like a early access thing and i just got an email about 40 minutes ago so I have like 20 minutes left, but I got an email, well, 30 minutes ago. I got an email 30 minutes ago and it was saying like back in stock. And I was like, here we go, like back in stock, like it's ready, but it's not. So I don't know why they would send out an email saying like back in stock when nothing is back in stock. I can keep looking. Oh my goodness, it's back in stock. <laughs> Oh, hold on. Why would they do that? Why would they do that? Literally, I'm so glad I checked. Oh no. Oh wait, no, that's my size. Yes. Why isn't that back in stock yet? I don't know if they're slowly like putting everything in stock on the site or what? But I have everything in my cart and it makes me want to check out because I don't want to lose any of the stuff. Well, I'm a little bummed because I was waiting for one of the bras to restock and it wasn't restocking this time. So everything that I put in my cart sold out. Okay, I don't know why I'm wearing this. I need to take it off. It's like 100 degrees outside. Okay, um, I'm going to get us tacos from this place called Gringos. I don't know if these places, I don't know if they're everywhere, but it's a taco place. And I'm going to get us tacos for lunch. So I'm going to do that. I need to, my cat is out here. Can I see him? Oh, of course, he's right in the middle of the road. I'm still really bummed about the skins launch. But so are a lot of people because I was looking at the Skims Instagram page and a ton of people are really disappointed. And I just like had stuff in my cart because I saw that some of the stuff was restocked, but it's like, I don't know. I should have just bought them, but I was waiting for this one bralette to be restocked and it didn't end up restocking or it restocked before way before I like was even looking at the page but I was looking at it a while before. I'm really bummed but it's fine. Some tacos will make me feel better. Back in the car. Christian's checking his mail but he's coming in the car too. Sorry if all you can hear is my air. We're going to buy a mattress I think. We looked online and the mattress price changed. We saw we told them we called and told them that it, we saw this certain price for the mattress and they were like oh well if you saw that online we can honor it so I'm hoping that's the case so we're gonna go do that and then I think we're gonna go to American Signature Furniture and look at bed frames even though we saw a bed frame it's so hot we saw a bed frame on Wayfair we were looking at Wayfair because they have like good deals and I also have a 10% off coupon but yeah
we were too hungry because it's 8.55 and we're eating a really late dinner. We just picked this up so we're eating it in the car. And I got cheese fries, which is something that I'm so excited for. The next day as you can see I'm home I came home to feed my cats and I also needed to grab a bathing suit so I just thought I would get ready here so I got ready um, put on a little bit of I put on sunscreen a little bit of tinted moisturizer that has sunscreen in it too and mascara and filled in my eyebrows just like some quick easy makeup I made my coffee here and now I'm about to go pick out a bathing suit. I think I'm gonna wear a red one, kind of be a little festive, you know, for Memorial Day. <laughs> Since it is kind of gloomy outside, my hair will probably end up going up if it definitely starts to rain. So I kind of just fixed it and just went over some of the curls that were already there. Didn't do anything special, and then I sprayed a ton of dry shampoo in the roots, and that's that. But yeah, I'm excited to go to the beach. I haven't been to the beach in Definitely over a year, I think. No, what am I saying? I went a few months ago. <laughs> what am I saying? Um, I haven't been to New Smyrna Beach, the beach that we're going to, in a very long time. So that's been a while. But I went to Clearwater Beach, I think like, wow, probably like eight months ago. It's a really long time. So it's been like eight months, but <laughs> for someone that lives in Florida, you'd think I'd be at the beach all the time. <laughs> I'm either gonna wear, ooh, this could be cute with it. Cause it's like low in the back, in that way. Cute, okay, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. If anyone is wondering where my outfit is from, these are actually from Abercrombie and Fitch. Um, yeah, it's really hard for me to find shorts that relatively fit well and have like the right amount of distressing. I just, my thighs are just like bigger than my waist, obviously. And it's just really hard to find shorts that don't do this. So yeah, and then my shirt is from Free People. It's really, really, really old. So they might have something similar, but. I thought I would do a little update on, I guess yesterday, because I didn't really explain anything. But we found a mattress. I don't know how we found a mattress for that price at all. Don't know how we did it, but we did it. The mattress gets delivered on our move-in day and yeah. Then all we have to do is order a bed frame and we're good to go. So yeah, and then we went and looked at couches and that's just gonna be like a whole nother story. It's just gonna be rough. <laughs> like we both like the same things, but couches are expensive for no reason. No reason. It's like a good thing that you really only have to buy furniture every so often. Like it's not often at all that you have to go buy furniture. So that's a good thing, but moving and purchasing furniture is expensive. That's the update, now I'm going to get us bagels from Einstein's. Are we surprised? It's like how many weekends in a row that I'm getting bagels, but it's just easy to do before the beach, so. I got our bagels and I don't think Christian's awake, so we're gonna go wake him up. <laughs> Cause it's 9.30, almost 9.40 actually. And we need to head to the beach. We need to go, yeah. I'm excited.
it is the next day. It's so rainy and gross outside. Um, it's Memorial Day, so I have it off of work. And I just can't wait to go home and like shower. But like I almost want to wait to shower because I'm going to work out later. I think I'm going to wait to shower. Um, I showered last night when I got home from the beach, but... I don't know the rain just like when you get caught in the rain because me and Christian went and got Chipotle for lunch and then we tried to go to Bed Bath & Beyond because they had I got an email that bedding was 25% off uh, through today yeah so we tried to go get the bed sheets today and Bed Bath & Beyond was closed and it's just one of those things that you need to go in and almost feel them and look at them just to see what you actually want and like so yeah I'm on my way home now I can't wait to relax the rest of the day until I actually have to work out <sighs> it's nice to have a three-day weekend it's nice to have today off so, so I just got home I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I hope you had an amazing weekend memorial day weekend um celebrating however you celebrated or wherever you celebrated i hope you're having a great day or night depending on when you're watching this and i will see you in my next video bye